Safira Radio News Service. Today is Wednesday, July 5th. We invite you to listen to the latest news from the life of Christian churches, both in Poland and around the world. We are the only ecumenical news service in Poland publishing daily. Poland. Young people are looking for an open church where they can honestly express their worries, problems, and sins. Jesus Stop, organized during the Poland Rock Festival, provides them with a safe and anonymous place to talk to clergy members. The event will take place in Chaplinek from July 31 to August 5. The Festival of Life in Kokotek Village has begun and has already attracted crowds of young people. Pope Francis sent them a letter with greetings. Participants came from various places in Poland and abroad. Numerous workshops and a unique concert took place yesterday. United Kingdom Bishop Paul McAleenan, responsible for migration issues in the Bishops' Conference of England and Wales, firmly said no to the deportation of immigrants from Rwanda. He commented on the decision of the appellate court, which ruled that the British government's deportation plan violates asylum legislation. Poland This time, the 13th Ignite Faith cycling pilgrimage started in an unusual way, with a train journey to Swinersai. Its destination is Lisbon and the World Youth Day. Two participants of the expedition will traverse the roads of Scandinavia, Germany, Benelux, and France. Another stage of the journey will begin in Paris when the rest of the group joins, and they will set off towards the Portuguese capital through mountainous routes. Registration is ongoing for this year's Days of Renewal of the Evangelical Methodist Church in Poland, which will take place from August 24th to 26th in Bielo Berzajai, by Lake Zygorzynski. Methodism is a post-Reformation religious movement that emerged organizationally from the Church of England in the 18th century. Daily prayers, meetings with interesting people, and concerts by Christian groups are just some of the events planned from July 31 to August 5 as part of the Polish Lisbon program. The schedule of events is published on the official websites of the National Organizational Office of World Youth Day. United Kingdom 16-year-old Chloe M.C. Roberts from Scotland couldn't read or write. Now, 10 years later, she is close to receiving an honors university degree. With the support of local authorities and her determination, Chloe decided to study at the University of Caledonia in Glasgow. In an interview with BBC Radio Scotland, she talked about her difficult educational journey, starting from discovering she had dyslexia to being diagnosed with ADHD. Chloe emphasizes that the upcoming moment of receiving her degree will be unforgettable. Poland a Krakow restaurant has been awarded two Michelin stars. Chef Pashemis Klima is the youngest master to receive a Michelin star. Other Polish restaurants have also received Michelin distinctions. One star was awarded to a restaurant in Potnan and one in Warsaw. Father Timothy Reed was unexpectedly called by God, and his life changed from that moment on. The St. Joseph Seminary YouTube channel presents many wonderful Catholic materials, including interviews about the priestly vocation. The interview with Father Timothy is particularly inspiring, and his story should be heard by young men considering the priesthood. Timothy received his calling during a retreat. Despite doubts and pain in his heart, he accepted the calling and embraced the challenge. He now enjoys his priesthood and considers it a blessing. The St. Joseph Seminary YouTube channel features more compelling vocation stories. That's all in the Safira Radio News Service. Join us as a listener, contributor or donor. Orthodox, Catholics, and Protestants together. May God bless us all.